the second thing, the things is the uh, Lilum need to create some cache file for the camera rock photo. For example, from the menu, in here, the performance, performance in here. So in here, the setting camera rock cache file in here, the location. So I show you by default, it will show you create a camera rock cache file on your system drive in here. And this is my SSD hard disk. And the size is not, not that big. So I want to reserve all possible memory for the system to use it. And in here, I have a hard disk in here. And I create a folder called cache file like this. Inside here, I create a cache file. For example, I create for Premiere Pro cache file. And also I create a Lilum camera rock cache file in here. I create it just from here and then get like this for Lilum camera rock cache file. So I create a folder in here. So this is the cache file for the Lilum to use. And that can be built up a lot so use a lot of space somehow so i don't want to put on my system hard disk in here i want to put it into here so in one place in here so i change the location for this i click choose the locations and go to my driver d like this driver d cache file in here inside here so and i select the folder as my camera rock cache file in here and also i give it more space in here for by default it's a 5 gigabyte i remember and i put it in 25 gigabyte here yeah so they will create the cache file inside here like this and somehow if you working on your lilum cache a lot uh camera rock cache file in here and you don't need them and you can just delete them from here or you can delete it from the preference in here so you click on here so this will clean up all the cache file from here so you can do that in this way yeah and uh, the next thing for the preference in here depend on how you want to do that for example like in here i have three monitor the one in here another one here and i have my 4k tv in here and sometimes i want to preview viewing some the photo so i can view it on the 4k tv in there and something the setting in here so i can show you what that mean and how we use that during the presentation on lilum training in here at the time when we need that in here so this is the way the first when i open up lilum to do that in here Thank you.